Raven Elise TV. Hey guys, what's up? It's Raven, and this video I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of an easier way to do your foundation and eyebrows. I recently got a bunch of new products from It Cosmetics, which really helped me get a flawless look, but without having to use too many different products. So I definitely wanted to try out these products and show it to you guys. I'm starting off with their lip moisturizer. This is just a really nice chapstick type product to moisturize your lips. And then I'm just moving on with my regular primers and priming my face as normal. Moving on to eyebrows, IT Cosmetics sent me their Super Skinny Brow Power Pencils and I'm using the one in medium brown and these are actually dual sided so it has the spoolie built in on one side and then the retractable pencil on the other side. And I love these just because it's convenient because you always need to brush your eyebrows out first anyway. And the actual pencil side, even though it is a retractable pencil, it is super skinny just like the title says so you're able to get those nice thin crisp lines whereas on on some other eyebrow pencils the tip is a little bit too chubby and you're not able to get a precise line so I love the fact that they made this super skinny version because it makes me a lot happier when I'm trying to outline my eyebrows so as you can see here I'm basically just following the natural shape of my brow and drawing the outline first and then I just go in with little hair strokes and fill in all the little bald spots of my eyebrow so that it looks nice and full I've tried a bunch of different products and a bunch of different methods to do my eyebrows, but this is really the first product that I'm able to just make it a one step process with just one pencil. I can use this pencil to brush my eyebrows out and outline them and fill them in. And I don't have to keep a sharpener on me or anything like that. So it makes it so much easier. Also, these pencils actually come in a wide variety of colors. So I was able to find the perfect color for my eyebrows. So after I outline them and fill them in, I just use the spoolie again to go back and brush them through to just kind of even everything out. And then I'm gonna be taking these concealers, which are actually the Bye Bye Under Eye Concealers, but they sent me a wide variety of shades. So I'm taking the Neutral Medium shade, which is a pretty bright shade, and I'm gonna use this to carve out my eyebrows with this little brush. So I just put a little bit of it on the back of my hand and dipped my brush in it, and I'm just carving out my eyebrows. And this concealer works really well for this because it's a nice thick creamy concealer so it gives you the most control if you're using a more watery concealer it's very hard to get those sharp lines but this concealer works really really well for this as long as you just use a small brush so you can see here that I'm actually moving very slowly so I can get that line nice and sharp and straight and it just covers up any blemishes that are near my eyebrows and it just makes my eyebrows look more perfect so once I get the concealer in place, I'm going in with the IT Cosmetics Complexion Brush and using the smaller side to go ahead and blend it out so that I don't have any harsh lines. And then after that, I just take the pencil again and go back and make any touch-ups. So moving on to the face, I'm going to be using the IT Cosmetics Color Correcting Full Coverage CC Creams. And I grabbed the one in tan and medium just to kind of see which one was going to match my skin tone. They come in this really cool pump container. So I decided that the tan color was actually better for me. So I'm taking that same brush but just using the other side of it and putting on the CC Cream. And I love this brush. It's very, very soft and it blends out the liquid product really really well and I noticed that these CC creams are not like a BB cream whereas usually a BB cream is very light coverage these are actually a full coverage product and so it's more like just a regular full coverage foundation except for the fact that it's you know better for your skin it has SPF 50 in it and anti-aging hydrating serums in it so it's kind of like a BB cream whereas it's good for your skin but it's a full coverage foundation at the same time so I was able to just apply one layer and get really really good coverage so so far I've only used three products on my face the eyebrow pencil the concealer and the CC cream and it's already starting to look pretty flawless so that's pretty good but for concealer I'm gonna go back to the it cosmetics bye bye under eye concealer but this time I'm grabbing the one in the shade tan and I'm just taking a brush and dotting it on at first just so I can really make sure I get enough product on there and I'm just placing it in
in a triangle formation kind of going down the sides of my nose and around my nostrils just to cover up any imperfections in that area as well and then I'm also going to take it and highlight my face with it as well so not only am I placing it under my eyes but I'm also going to place it on my cupid's bow my chin and my forehead And then I'm just going to blend out all this concealer using my damp sponge. And this concealer actually blends out surprisingly well, even though it is a thicker full coverage concealer, it actually blends out really easily. I was very surprised. So now instead of using a bunch of different powders to set all the different areas of my face, I'm just going to use this one powder. It's the IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Powder and then I'm also using their fluffy brush. And I'm just going to kind of pack it on a little bit heavier underneath my eyes and on my highlighted areas just so that I know that those areas are really set because those are the areas that tend to crease up and get oily. And then I'm also just gonna do kind of a light sweep of it over the rest of my face so that my whole face is set. So now that my face is done, I can go back and finish up my eyebrows. So I'm taking that same eyebrow pencil and I like to kind of just extend my eyebrows a little bit closer in towards each other, if that makes any sense. So I kind of like to extend that lower line and then you see here, I'm just drawing on little hairs in the front part of my eyebrows so that it looks more natural and more full in the front. And then that's it for eyebrows and foundation. It's really simple, really easy, not using too many products. Um, I'm not going to show you the whole bronzer, contour, highlighting, eyes part of it, but I did want to show you what it would look like with everything on. So this is me with bronzer, blush, highlighter, and my eyes done. And I also wanted to show you this IT Cosmetics Mascara. This is their Hello Lashes Mascara, and I actually fell in love with it because of the way that the wand is. It has the regular part of the wand where you would just put on your mascara as normal like I'm doing here, but then you go back and you take the tip of the one which has the little ball on it and you can use it to separate out your lashes and really get in there and make sure that you're getting every single lash which overall just gives your lashes a more full and you know kind of fluttery look and I feel like it really makes my lashes look longer and thicker so I love this mascara when I wore this mascara on snapchat I got a lot of questions about my lashes and if I was wearing falsies but no it was just this mascara so I would definitely recommend it. So yeah, I just wanted to throw that in there, but that is the finished look. Let me know if you guys wanna see a tutorial on this eye look. I can do a separate video for the eyes. But yeah, that's it. I really liked all the products that I tried from IT Cosmetics. It definitely simplified my routine, as you can see, but it gave a really nice finished product. So let me know what you think down below, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you.